toilets are our friends. They eliminate our shame and they don't tell stories. And someone constructed a massive underground system that deals with our waste so we don't have to think about it. You can tell if a man or woman last used a toilet emoji by the orientation of the seat forward slash lid. I'm not sure what these angled lids are meant to do, it's like pushing you off. These with a side view look like a really hungry glove puppet. Emoji dads have one of those future toilets that nobody's comfortable with. Not many of these have visible flush mechanisms, so I guess you just use them until they're and then move on to the next toilet. Uh, I was gonna say messenger, but now I've noticed the lack of flush. Emoji one. Next. Water closet is what nobody calls toilets. The abbreviation WC is actually short for why call it that. This is one of those abbreviations that wastes time because you have to explain what it stands for. Then you have to explain how that somehow means a toilet and not a closet full of water. The good one is HTC. They're so clever. They've portrayed the water closet symbol sitting on the toilet. Of course, if you look inside the toilet... <sighs> yeah, okay, here it is, on screen, mixed emoji. The legendary pile of poo emoji. It is kind of cute. It's it's enthusiastic. It's worth noting that the emoji name does not suggest it would have a face, but Apple, of course, have set the cultural standard with this. There's those guys from Dragon Quest. There's a kind of excrement version of Clippy. This one's looking the wrong way. Messenger is really committing to the excited face to an extent that I would call intentionally hyperbolic, perhaps even satirical. Then there's a variety of baby forms. Then this, again, intentionally over embellished anime one. You can feel the personality of the artist responding to what they've been asked to draw. There's a default instinct to opt for the Apple one out of familiarity, but I think this is a case where Microsoft's thick line style really does some favours. It's a really efficient design, unambiguous in what it's portraying, but not really evoking disgust. Best turd. I need a shower after that. Which shower emoji you'd go for depends largely on how you light your showers. As disco spotlights, an earphone, an icy laser spike attack, one of those domes you use in a restaurant to unveil the main course, but the main course is water, emergency sprinklers, an absolute torrent, this pathetic messenger offering, I expected better of you, and I should have counted these before I started the long sentence of what they really look like format, I don't have anything clever for the Twitter one, it's just bad. The Mozilla one seems okay after that, but isn't. This is a flying saucer, optimized for seven abductions at a time, efficient. And then just whatever that is. Look, I'm saying Google, it's concise, you can kind of tell it's a shower. I need a bath after that. The bath, or the person taking it, in the context of undergoing a bath and not, like, stealing the tub. It's inadvisable to fall asleep in a bath. You're better off having an existential crisis. If the water's too hot, you have to kind of balance yourself on the rim until it cools down. Don't forget your bath lipstick. Even Ancat Ball takes a bath sometimes. I might need another bath after doing that reference. Why does HTC's person look much more explicit than the rest? I mean, they're all naked. I guess the length of that limb brings a lot of questions, and that's a very steamy crotch. You could also fill your bath with ice cubes and use it to preserve your head collection. If there's a raised part of the rim, then that's where your back's meant to be, isn't it? There's a whole half bath of suspicious space here, and those bubbles. Is there someone else under there? To put it simply, I think Messenger's character is drowning someone with their legs. This Mozilla guy is really worried. I think he's on some futuristic operating table, and that medical droid has gone haywire. Emoji 1, if that's a knee, then the pal Elvis is here and the... no, no, no. And either this bath is vacant or its occupant is hidden below the rim whilst the shower head snakes up above its prey. Well, that was an experience. Only Apple's has a visible tap, but it's all out of shape, and these without bubbles just look like the occupant is in there dry. So, algae, I guess. The just plain old bathtub emoji has much the same tap-lack problem in most designs. What do you do if an American tap isn't working? Force it. What do you do if a British faucet isn't working? Tap it. Thing is, without a person in it, the LG one looks more like a wash basin. Twitter and Mozilla have some of Robot Wars' worst contestants. I like this emoji that's one, which brings us to the, oh, the end card, okay. If you like this video, I bet you feel so important.